Look at how the girls invade mommy's bedroom. They are all over my bed. It's past midnight here. I'm done wa doing what I was doing. And I want to sleep. But they have taken over the whole, whole, whole bed. I don't have a space to sleep. But you know what? When I see this, I feel so happy. I'm so excited. You know, they refused to sleep in their bedroom. They refused to sleep on, in their bed. And they said they want to sleep with mommy today. Now look at this. They are all over. They are all over, all over, all over. Deeply asleep. This makes me happy. It makes me feel that now these babies can feel loved, can feel accepted, can feel appreciated. And they are now feeling the freedom to enjoy the love that they are being given. They have, they, they, they have, you can see, they, you see? See the way they, they have taken over my bed? It can tell you that they, they, they are having a sense of belonging. They feel this is where they belong. I'm so happy for them. You see the way they are sleeping is not by coincidence. These babies, they are, they have not, they have not yet mastered the art of sleeping properly in a bed from when you slept to morning, and you sleep in a good position, because uh, mo when they were in in the slum, they were sleeping on the floor, literally on the floor, so they would roll and roll any corner, any howly. And if you look at them, they, they are not even covered. They don't have the, they, they have thrown away all the blankets because they have still not yet uh, mastered the, the, the art of always covering themselves with a blanket because in the slum they, they were used to sleep without the blanket. So even when they were very new in our house, they used to fall. At night they fall from the bed. Then we wake up at night, we find them, them on the floor, we pick them up, put them on bed again. At, for a night they would fall like two times or three times. Then you wake up, you go and pick them up and put them back. So they are still learning how to sleep on bed and how to utilize beddings, how to cover themselves with the beddings. Otherwise for them, whether with beddings or not, life goes on. With bed or on the floor, life goes on. So I'm happy for our girls. And this will become great, great, great women in future. They are great women of God. They will be great women doing great things, nationally and internationally, in Jesus' name. Yeah, I'm happy they feel loved and they feel a sense of belonging. So now I have to align them, put them to sleep properly <laughs> so that I can have some little space for me to sleep until morning <laughs> oh, these girls huh?